Hey guys, and welcome back. It's Polo Man here. Uh, today I want to do an update on the base defense uh, video that I did the other day. Uh, I wanted to kind of give you guys an update of where I was at. And uh, the biggest conclusion I can come to with base defense, uh, talking to other guys in my cartel, and uh, some of you out there that uh, have given me some feedback, there is, at this level, really no good base defense there's always somebody going to come along and beat you um, i've tried several different defense setups uh, this is the one i showed you guys the other day and uh, even though i've spread it out they come right up this left side over here they take out stuff and come right through there right up to my finca even with the bombs they take this stuff out and i'm done uh, as you can see here on the left, I've had several home base raided. Now, the thing that I want to stress to you guys here is look at these as an opportunity. Instead of getting all depressed, okay, you lose a medal. But guess what? When you beat this guy, you're going to get your medal back. So it's really not a big deal. So that you get the extra benefit of getting the resources taking the resources when you get this revenge go take the revenge you get extra resources if you would have defended you wouldn't get these resources yeah you would have kept your medal but you get your medal back anyway when you beat this person so it's a win-win situation i go through every night when i take my shield off see my resources were protected by a shield i didn't lose any resources to any of these people i lost my medal but i'm going through and getting them back as as, as i go through so Look at this as an opportunity for you guys to go take revenge on these people. Get the added resources that, uh, you know, are available. Hopefully we can attack this person here. Uh, you know, here's 117,000 cash, 81,000 wood, 56,000 stone, 23,000 iron, and I get my metal back if I win this. So... It's, uh, well, we're not taking that one out, apparently. So let's go look at another one. Um, this person's usually available um, to take out. But you're getting these resources back. You didn't even lose the resources because you were under shield. Well, I was under shield, but um, you have the opportunity to come back on these people and get these resources where if you just defended your base you're not getting that same opportunity you're, you're gonna keep your medal yes but I'm gonna get my medal back when I beat this base and that's that's all there is to it so it's for me I mean it's really a no-brainer I've even, you know, I've stopped upgrading. I work on my, on my def. I stopped upgrading my defense. Work on my offense. What's the point of putting all your money into your defense? There's always going to be somebody to beat it. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. I'm getting beat over and over again. Everybody in my cartel, they're getting beat by people lower level than them doing doing uh doing them in you you can't defend against them you just can't defend against everybody here i'm gonna leave this no i'm gonna get the nerve gas cannon so really there's there's not a lot left here we've taken out most of it with the fire bombs awesome fire bombs i got the upgrade two scorpions sicarios it's just uh it's really cool you guys, if you don't have these scorpions, you got to get them. They are so worth it. Just keep taking these out. We're going to move right up to the finca. Pop some of these out. There's really not going to be much here. And boom, we lost one guy. So, pretty easy to do. And look at these resources I got. 126,000, 87,000, 67,000, 26,000, and almost 8,000 dope. So um, you can't beat that. And this is going to cost me my entry fee into the attack and one person to reinforce 7,800. Boy, I really made out there. You guys aren't going to get these easy battles 
if you continue to defend. So think about that. Think about your strategy. You know, continue to level up your defense as you can, but uh, I feel it's more important overall to build a strong offense where you're able to battle, take these people out, continue to get your resources. Eventually you'll get your defense where you want it, but I haven't found anybody yet that they've given me that I haven't been able to beat. So think about that too, and you guys are probably the same way. If you guys got any questions, put them in the comments below. I'll be happy, happy to answer them. Uh, if not, please subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you next time.